But we love you. Wow. Wow. I'm wow. saying it with love. I'm saying it with love. Come on. Don't make me feel bad. Don't make me feel bad. Yeah, because you're telling everyone. But we love you. Wow. <laughs> anyway, welcome. Welcome to our kitchen. We are back with uh, an amazing meal that we're about to make. So this is brown fried rice um, with um, all these condiments, mixtures over here. Yeah. So the rice is almost ready. We're making it right here on the rice cooker. So we, right. have, we have mushrooms. You can use, these are oyster mushrooms. You can use butter mushrooms. You can use uh, Indian and Italian. Portobello, whichever mm -hmm. mushrooms you find. Uh, these are bell peppers. There's a uh, yellow, red, and she's she'll cut the green because and actually the color it pops the color pops when it's you, very important when you mix up yeah this, you mm -hmm. know there's green there's red there's yellow there's corn which is yellow as well and there's cashew nuts yeah and then we have our spices here so spices is up to you to be honest whatever, whatever like. spices up your whatever life whatever spices up your life but here we have paprika we have black pepper we have cumin uh, and we have some curry we have powder. Some curry powder that's really really good. And then I think we'll need some turmeric. Just give me some turmeric from there. All right. Yeah. So um, I will get the rice from the rice cooker. Should be ready by now. It's really steaming hot. Steam, steamed ready. So with the brown rice, by the way, it's good to soak it. Soak the rice for like about eight hours or overnight. Just keep it soaking and then drain the water. That and is see. hack number one. Hack number one. Soak <laughs> the rice. So I'm going to pulse the onions with our magical our magic chopper. Magic chopper. One, two, three pulses. Okay, so we'll get the oil ready. We will use macadamia oil as we always do. Our oil is ready, so we're gonna put some onions. If you like to mix your onion and your garlic, it's very good. But we just realized we don't have garlic today, so we're just gonna use some garlic I powder. The garlic. Everyone will put the spices at different points when they're cooking, so it's up to you when you want to do that. May I put black pepper at this point? He chooses to put black pepper at this point, <laughs> like he said. Your way is also the right way. So, um, looking at what we have here, there's a certain order that you should follow. Okay. Because I like the mushrooms to be very crispy. <laughs> yeah. So I want them to come first. I agree. Yeah. I am not a professional chef, by the way. So all the professional chefs will look at me like, no, that's not how you do it. But he is a professional in other things. <laughs> <laughs> tell them. All right, now we add some garlic powder. And then, guess what's next? And I recommend if you can be able to roast the cashews before. Yeah, so that they have a crunch. Or even, even on your pan if you want to. Yeah, even on the pan. Yeah. Depending on what kind of flavors you want to add. Yeah. Oh, oh, I'm oh. really enjoying this position. <laughs> I would like to point that out. <laughs> now I add spices now here. Yeah. So I want to add the cumin. Is it cumin or cumin? I don't know. Some people say cumin, some people say cumin, but I think it's cumin. Ah, okay, so I covered it for, I'm going to tell you for like two minutes maybe. And then we will proceed from there. And add the sweet corn. That should like just be sweet corn and rice together at the same time so we can add the corn right now and we add the rice as well and the rice yes. yeah because everything is cooked and ready yeah so the corn was already boiled actually the corn was pre-boiled the rice is pre-boiled just add the rice and that's it and then the turmeric for color, this is it. And paprika, you and didn't paprika put. Oh, I should have put paprika before that, this one. And a bit of salt. And then we are going to mix this up. Look at that, it looks so good, it's so colorful. So remember, color on, like, food it makes you want to eat more and more. Exactly. So, this is some cashew milk that was remaining, so I can add some cashew milk on here instead of adding water. And we are about to indulge. 
Oh my god. Oh, MG. Let me get a fork ready. <laughs> it looks so good, right? Yeah, so let us indulge. We are ready. Can you taste it. Why are you going to feed me as I feed you? Oh, I know. You can't sing that song. We're not going to pay for the rights for that song, babe. Ten, 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 ten. Hmm. Mm -mm -mm -mm. <laughs> Thank you. Can... You know. Thank you <laughs> for joining us in our kitchen. Yeah. It was a pleasure to have you. <laughs> it was a pleasure to have you. Please be well. Keep safe. Mm. Social distance and. If you decide to try this recipe, please tag us. Mm -hmm. We'll see you next time. Thank you.